Mogi and Maggie return home only to be greeted by a strange little girl sleeping soundly on their beds. An angel! Father Bear jumped in joy. Oh, dinner! Mother Bear replied. Maggie, I wish for another child since you are too old to bear another. Mother Bear sighed. Fine then, let's be the finest interspecies parents ever! So they adopted her and named her Goldilocks. They took care of her when she was sick, celebrated her birthdays, and even built a playground for her just to name a few things. But one day, she suddenly vanished. Only after many years did she return to give her thanks in blood. The house and the hidden treasures of the bears beneath her feet were all hers now, unbeknown to her. Mugi stood paralyzed at the death of his beloved wife, at the hands of his daughter. His eternal nightmare had just begun. He cried out, truly, the Lord made a mistake and called it human.